I, th I think it's because people always have been able to compartmentalize their thinking. Like, people can say we should stop using plastic, single-use plastic, when in fact single-use plastic is one of the most important things in healthcare. You know, masks and gloves and vinyl tubing and blood bags and all these things, you, you can't use them again because they may be contaminated. And so the concept of single-use plastic is a stupid one to ban. Maybe you should ban some things that are single-use, but I'm not too much in favor of banning anyways. You know, unless it's actually hurting something. But people don't realize that the war on plastics is just a proxy for the war on fossil fuels. Because they are made from fossil fuels, by and large. Polypropylene, polystyrene, polyvinyl chloride, all these polymers. The other thing that people don't understand is that plastic has been in nature since the beginning. Cellulose is a plastic. It is a polymer of glucose. And life learned to make cellulose to make fibers, which is what they are, the synthetic polymers are fibers. They're a chain of individual molecules, all of the same, polypropylene. So that is the, the, the polymer, but then there's the monomer, which is the individual unit of a polymer. And that's exactly what cellulose is. So cotton is plastic. Oh, I see. Cotton is pure cellulose. That's why it's in a string. So you can weave it. Cellulose is what trees are made of. That is plastic. So trees are made of plastic that nature produced. So there's nothing like sort of awful about plastic. It is actually a perfectly natural thing. And we've learned to make it out of the fossil fuels that were once life. So the trees that made the coal were plastic. And then we can take the coal and make new kinds of plastic with it in our factories. So this is what people should know, but they don't because no one is going to tell them and the people in charge probably don't know it either.